Pastor Benny and Pat Holmes of the Church of New Beginnings, along with the congregation, invite you to their fourth annual Fire in July conference, beginning Wednesday night, June 30th, 2010, at 7 p.m., continuing Friday and Saturday nights, July 1st and 2nd, at 7 p.m. Guest speakers include Evangelist John Bailey on Wednesday night, Evangelist Rafina Dotson on Thursday night, Minister Denise Hagee, wife of Captain Jack Hagee with Precinct 3 Harris County Constables on Friday night. Culminating on Sunday morning with a dynamic team of staff ministers from the Church of New Beginnings, Assistant Pastor Jimmy Woods, Associate Pastor Lord Scott, and Youth Pastor Doug Edwards. We'll see you there. This news story contains video footage of two major accidents that occurred recently in Baytown, Texas. Baytown Police, EMS, and Fire and Rescue responded to the scenes of the accidents. The first accident occurred on Cedar Bayou Lynchburg on June 19, 2010 and involved three vehicles. One of the drivers said he sneezed while driving and suddenly noticed a vehicle immediately ahead of him. He swerved around the vehicle to avoid hitting it, but collided with an oncoming vehicle. All victims of the accident were reported to be in stable condition, but two were taken by ambulance to the hospital. The second accident occurred on the feeder road of Interstate 10 West near the Piedmont Apartments on Thursday, June 24, 2010. The driver of the vehicle lost control and careened into the iron fence that surrounded the apartment building. The driver of the vehicle managed to escape serious injury. It looked like he had a blowout, the tire had blew out. Right front? Yeah. Okay, yeah, because yeah. I, I was coming right here and he's just... He was thinking about to cut him off, but uh, he, he, he had a tire blowout. Yeah, I talked to another witness over there and he said that, well, he'd already left. But I asked him if he had hit him, my friend was messed up. He said, no, I'm just, just seeing what, what happened because it looked like he was slumped over when he went that way. I didn't... 